Hi, this is James from OnlineITGuy.com, and we're talking about Adobe Reader X or Reader 10. Um, a couple of weeks ago, Adobe finally introduced Reader X or Reader 10, and it's a big step forward in security for um, your internet usage. Adobe estimates that 90% of the uh, computers out there have Adobe Reader already installed on them. And because of that popularity, Adobe Reader has been targeted a lot by malware over the past year. And there have been a lot of attacks that simply by visiting a website and unknowingly downloading a cra uh, maliciously crafted uh, PDF file, your computer can become easily infected by malware. So Adobe has finally introduced uh, Reader 10 or Reader X or whatever you want to call it. Um, and that introduces an idea called sandboxing. And basically what the idea is is that um, Adobe Reader opens pages and, and the, the media that's in them in a, in a kind of a protected mode so that it can't get to your computer as easy and can't get to important files on your computer. It's kind of stuck in its own sandbox where it's got to play with itself. Um, now, this isn't going to be perfect. It's, Adobe itself does, says it's not a silver bullet to kill all the problems with malware that are, are causing problems with Adobe Reader. But it is a big step to keeping your computer safe. And I suggest that you do install Adobe Reader X or Reader 10 or whatever. Um, you can't do it right now by doing a simple upgrade from the file menu. You actually have to go to the Adobe website and download Adobe Reader. It is the Ado uh, Reader X or Reader 10 is the reader that you download now by, by choice on the Adobe website. Um, but you have to act actually go there and install it. So I suggest you go to adobe.com. Um, I'll follow this up with uh, some instructions on how to install Adobe Reader X or Reader 10 on your computer. Okay, to install Adobe Reader X or Reader 10, go to adobe.com in your browser. I'm doing this in Internet Explorer. Then all you have to do is scroll down to the downloads and click on Adobe Reader. Now, you need to wait until you get this and uncheck this. So I don't need the Google toolbar. And then click Download Now. And Internet Explorer, you'll get this warning up here. Click on Add This install this add-on for all users on this computer and there'll be one more pop-up like this and that allows it to install you'll notice that these instructions are all repeated on the Adobe website right here and then Adobe's download manager will pop up and I'll quick fast forward to having this all installed here or downloaded. Okay, it's all downloaded and now it's installing uh, Adobe Reader X. and you'll get the installation is complete and you can close the download manager and you're all done. You could then open up Adobe Reader X and accept their thing and it's all installed. I hope you've downloaded and installed Adobe Reader X okay and I uh, hope you like the new features that it has and the added protection it gives you as you surf the internet. And if you found this video useful, please give me a thumbs up on YouTube or um, visit my website at onlineitguide.com. Thanks.